kicking and clawing at those weaknesses to change them to stop them some days I win but some days I don't but each and every day I get back up and I move forward with my fists clenched toward the battle toward the struggle and I fight with everything I've got to overcome those weaknesses and those shortfalls and those flaws as I strive to be just a little bit better today than I was yesterday I can tell you everything I've done the only thing I can't do is grind for you what's the difference between a gazelle and what's the difference between a lion the gazelle is running from something and that's a lot of you in this room you will run you'll do what you're supposed to do as long as you're getting pushed but as soon as that stops you stop so you've got to ask yourself what's your why what motivates you what pushes you what drives you Every opportunity is the last opportunity. Every opportunity, I have to reprove myself again. Every opportunity, I'm still nervous. E.T., you've been doing this for years. Why are you so nervous? Because the day you become content, the day you stop evaluating yourself, the day you stop growing, the day you stop getting better, is the day you die, is the day the person who's trying to catch you will get you. I'm here to tell you today, if you got a, somebody came to my office the other day crying, I said, look, don't cry to give up, cry to keep going. Don't cry to quit. You already in pain, you already hurt, get a reward from it. Fight. Go down swinging. And I'll tell you, if you fight with all you have, more often than not, you won't go down at all. You will win. But you have to make that attitude a part of your everyday life. Do the extra repetition. Run the extra mile. Go the extra round. Make the right choices. Give the full measure. Make yourself stronger, mentally and physically. Stand and fight fight against weakness against fear against time and against decay fight back go down swinging give every day everything you've got and when you face a challenge even something you don't believe you can win or a situation where you know you cannot win remember this you have nothing to lose so stand up Go forward, go out in a blaze of glory, fighting with everything you've got, every ounce of energy, every bead of sweat, every drop of blood until your last breath. And then, and only then, can you stand down. If you're gonna be successful in this game, you gotta have a dog within you. You gotta know it's a dog fight, and you gotta go get that fight. Life ain't gonna be easy, ain't nobody gonna hand you nothing. Just cause you got a degree, you think cause you got a degree and you wrote a book, they about to bow down to you, that's just that one boo in this game. Good people can't really handle them on the level that someone who's great is. So you're praying for greatness and a problem comes and you're running from the problem. You don't understand that it is in solving the problem that you become wealthy. You don't understand that when you solve that problem, you solve something that a two other million people couldn't solve. And so once you solved it, that solving the problem elevated you. The longer you wait, the longer you wait. I'm being real. The longer you wait to get started and just start grinding, the longer you're gonna wait to get to the other side and get that reward. There's nothing wrong with the opportunity. You're not giving 120, you're giving 70. You're giving 60, you're giving 50, and you won't with these people who've given sweat, who's given blood, who's given tears. You won't what they paid for, and it ain't free.
takes both emotion and logic to reach your maximum potential, to really give everything you have to go beyond your limits. Because emotion and logic will both reach their limitations. And when one fails, you need to rely on the other. When it just doesn't make any logical sense to go on, that's when you use